My feet are cold. It's not me. It's my feet. Hello, Zoe. Yeah, it's very chilly outside. Is it? Mm -hmm. Well, I went with my sweater and everything. Now it's cold. Yeah. No worries. No worries. It's all good. It's all good. <clears throat> Hi, Thomas. How are you, honey? Oh, I never messaged Ashley to tell her I was going live. She messaged me the other day and asked when I was going live again. Oh, baby. And I told her I didn't think I was going to be live till next week. But, uh... I decided to go live anyways today, so <clears throat> um, I'm looking for a pencil to go and shade this. Okay, so I'm going to try to shade this, the rest of this page as best I can. And then um, hopefully I will be able to um, start on my one... Um, Space Miniatures page. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> oh my gosh, I haven't colored in like over a week, so I'm a little, uh, <laughs> what? <clears throat> I'm a little, uh, Rusty, I guess I could say. Hi, Don. How are you, honey? Mm, hang on. Let me see if I can turn off my Bluetooth and we'll just... No, 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 kitty. Can you grab her? All right. We're going to go without Bluetooth today and just use my phone. <coughs> uh, do that. And turn it up. Come here, little Miss Thing. She does it every time I go live. It's almost like she knows. Like Will. <clears throat> yeah. Just like Will. Yep, exactly. As soon as she knows I'm live, it's like, oh, she's talking to people. I need to go see what she's doing. <clears throat> So, it's been a pretty crazy week for me. You guys can hear me okay, right? I hope. <clears throat> can you all hear me okay? Are we good? Oh, Momo, come on, baby. Miss Mocha. No, no, no. Oh. You're really not going to let... Sorry, guys. I have a cat pushing my freaking camera stand. Really, kitty cat? <laughs> oh, shit. What? You leave him alone. Look, yeah, he's sleeping. Leave him alone, you little bugger. Don't get him going, you little shit. <clears throat> Moon's actually being good for a change. 
staying out of ruckus. Okay, so let's get shading these. I haven't really finished many pages this month, so hopefully I'll be able to by the end of the month. I haven't colored, like I said, in about a week. Well, almost a whole two weeks, to be honest. So, that being said, I have some catch-up to do. I haven't gotten any new books. Uh, finances don't allow that right at the moment. <sighs> Here she comes again. She just come the other way this time. It's fine, just leave her. She's gonna keep doing it anyways, so... She's not gonna stop. everybody been um i know i'm i really want the new um uh the new gabby wolf one that just came out i just haven't been able to get it so Way so it's easier for me, so this isn't in the way. <clears throat> yeah, I want that one too. I've been looking at that one. Well, I've been looking at it, Mandy. I'm not sure if I <clears throat> I want to see flip throughs before I choose. And, and decide on the book itself. <clears throat> so. I don't know. Lately, I've just... With coloring books, I have to see flip-throughs now. Um, to make a choice. Because I don't feel like being burned. And I'm become very, very picky nowadays. <clears throat> oh, I can't remember whose book it was. Um, I don't know who, who makes it, but it's called Starcana. Thank you, Dawn. Thank you, sweetie. <clears throat> Dada. No. That's okay, so Dawn, stay as long as you can. Just you showing up and saying hi is, you know, support. And I appreciate it. <clears throat> My stomach has been doing flip-flops all week. It's been acting very, very strange all week. Apparently, there's like a huge gastric flu or something going around really bad right now. I'm just going to turn the fan on because the sun in here is kind of uh, <clears throat> like there's windows all around me. So there's sun beating in. Outside is chilly, but where I am coloring, the sun is beating in and it's like sweating to death here <clears throat> I don't I didn't show it uh, Zoe did yeah the one with the frog the new RJ Hampson one
There we go. There's those. I'm just going to blend them out a bit so it's not like a harsh line. Thank you, Mandy. It's just been a really stressing week. We were at um, the hospital with my daughter all week, so doing tests and stuff. So, yeah, just been a lot going on. That's all. <clears throat> Okay, I'll be right back. Talk amongst yourselves. I'll be right back. I'm so sorry guys. So, so sorry. <sighs> okay, I'm back. I think I'm good now. <laughs> Again, I apologize. That was not planned. <clears throat> Why is this not... It's bothering me. It's funny how your nerves can do so much damage to your body, you know. And stress and worry and stuff, you know. 
what it can really do to your system. It's crazy. Oh, this ain't gonna get any smoother than it is, so I guess I can't really fix it much now, can I? But I did get to spend the week with my, my two kids and my husband, so I mean, we did have some family time out of it, right? So that was a good thing in the, you know, we're trying to think of the positive and the, all of that, so. <clears throat> okay, I do not have much to shade left. I only have the tree trunk and then the grass down here and these two little pumpkins and the leaves and this these flowers and then these little birds but <clears throat> you know what maybe we'll start I'll put these pencils aside and we'll start on my I'll put this aside for now and we will base my uh, camellia and or my um, space miniatures page for today which one was it <clears throat> this one this is this month's page so <clears throat> let me get this one out and we will get started with that with my markers Paper to go underneath. <clears throat> and so we're going to do this with markers and we will go from there. We'll see if I need to uh, shade it or not. Usually um, these pages I'm pretty good with my markers, but we'll have to see how we work out with it. So <clears throat> just going to move all this stuff in my page. I was working on some those pencils over. <clears throat> um, get these out in this set. So this is um, for mine and Tammy colors too. We're doing the Space Buddies um, theme <clears throat> um, every month. Well, there's a hashtag with a different page from the book. <clears throat> so um, this is the page from uh, April. I know. I'm sorry. My brain is all over the place, guys. I apologize. Jeez horrible. What is happening here? I don't know what's happening here. Okay, there we go. I know you're live. Yes, my love. But do you have an extra charger? Can you use an extra cube? For what? My Oculus. Um, I gave one to Dad. Check in that here. I don't know if I have a cube, but that's a cord you can use. Oh, it has a cube on it. There you go. Ah. Thank you. Magic. Ta-da! Okay, so... <clears throat> um, and as for the answer to your question uh, earlier, Mandy... Um, yeah, she's, she's okay. She has to go back in a month for her eye surgery. Um, I tried to explain a little bit of what was going on with her before the last live, like, the last live that I did, but... Um, so she has a tumor disease which is hereditary uh i got it from my dad i passed it on to some of my kids and um <clears throat> so when she was born the pediatrician i asked him because her eye looked different her one eye and i asked the pediatrician he said oh it's just a lazy eye <clears throat> it should you know it should pass you know as she grows well it never did 
So come to find out that she was actually born with a giant cataract behind her eye. So she's never been able to see out of her one eye her entire life. We did not know this. So <clears throat> that eye is completely damaged. Now her good eye has a tumor that's leaking uh, fluid into her eye. So they're going to do laser surgery in a month. And... Um, And they're going to, you know, cauterize it and stuff like that. So, yeah, <clears throat> that's where we're at at the moment with her. <clears throat> so, let's see what colors I want to do here. I know I want to do these, like, blue and purpley kind of galaxy-ish. <clears throat> I'm just not sure which kind of blues I want to go with it. <clears throat> So I think I'm going to go with like a potato purple and let's see, maybe a rust purple, rust purple and bluebell, what do you think? So those two colors here. Or should I do the violet and the bluebell? <clears throat> Thank you, Mandy. I appreciate it, honey. <clears throat> I never did swatch those out either, these colors here. So, let's see. Violet, purple, and bluebell, you think? <clears throat> you see the violet purple from this set I'm going to check it with the one color I just tested <clears throat> yeah I think we might go with that mm, Indian blue is too blue Actually, that might actually look pretty, those two colors. Okay, so I'm going to go with Indian blue and <clears throat> violet for the little whatever they are. <clears throat> I don't know if they're like pomegranates to them or what, but... <clears throat> Thank you, Dawn. I appreciate it. <clears throat> I do believe in the power of prayer. It really does have some miraculous powers <clears throat> so I am going to use Indian blue do I get Indian blue on this? no actually let me see something process blue is a little lighter yeah that's too light <clears throat> Yeah, Lynn's okay, uh, Dawn. She's just got company over. I think she's got her son or her, and her grandkids over. So, yeah, she's okay. That's good, Mandy. That's good to hear, sweetie. I'm a little rusty because, like I said, I haven't colored in like two weeks almost. Well, a week and a half. So, bear with me. Ugh. Like I said, I'm a little rusty. Just a little rusty. So yeah, that's what she's going through. And <clears throat> we were up in Toronto uh, for the week. Uh, the hospital put us up in a hotel, which was nice because where we live, we live about three hours away from the <clears throat> hospital where she has to be. So it's a lot for her to travel back and forth to back-to-back -back appointments so <clears throat> that's good to hear Mandy that's really good to hear honey um, so uh, yeah that's where we're at with her
I mean, we got to stay there and, it, you know, relax. I mean, the hospital was literally, you went out the front doors, the one doors of the hotel, and it was like you walked across the street and it was, you were at the front doors. So, <clears throat> hi, Callie. Welcome, welcome, honey. You're okay. So, you're all good, sweetie. <clears throat> So, yeah, it was nice for her to um, go from her appointment to pretty much a bed and just be in comfort. <clears throat> okay, so what do you guys think of that? Should I go lighter with the blue? Because I do want to use my white paint pen and just put little, like, a few little dots on it. Or do you, do you guys think that blue is too dark? Because as it dries, it's supposed to be more like this color here, like right here. That's the Indian blue when it dries, not the lower one. Mind, ignore that, just this one here. <clears throat> so. <clears throat> okay, yeah, I got my paint pen, so I can outline it in a pastel blue and just kind of make it pop right <clears throat> bye Dawn thank you for coming honey So, Zoe, I'm assuming you haven't colored anything as of yet with your new markers because you've just finished watching them, right? <clears throat> Is that what I am guessing? Am I guessing right? sure what color to color here yet but we'll figure it out as we go are you waiting till you get home to color something with them is that what you're doing or planning on coloring something at mom's You're so pretty! Oh my gosh. It's for our birthday. Okay, so I'm gonna flip the phone around to show you my daughter. She's uh, going to her friend's surprise birthday party. Uh, just let me turn it around. Oh, not me. Yee. That's what she looks like. Look at her, so pretty. It's my girl. Oh. Sorry about my ugly mug, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> oh, I have to zoom back out. Oh my gosh, it's so zoomed in. What the heck is happening right now? Why? What is happening? Oh my gosh. I shouldn't even be zoomed in. Why am I so zoomed in? Hang on, guys. Sorry. 
<clears throat> no, I don't want to stop. There we go. I think I got it. I think. Sorry, guys. I don't know what's happening. Ugh, I can't. What is happening? Why won't this unzoom? What the hell? Why can I not unzoom this? This is driving me crazy. Summer, fix my phone. I can't unzoom it. I don't know how to help you. I don't know either. I've tried. It's not doing it. It's being stupid. Okay. <laughs> well then, I guess we are staying zoomed in the way we are, aren't we? I can't Get can fix up. it. Get a close up, I guess. Well, isn't that just peachy? Why? My phone is stupid, let me tell you. Everybody says, you're gorgeous. You look beautiful. Thanks, Thanks she says. Yeah, I can't. Un oh, my gosh. Okay. Okay, I might have to come back to this. I don't know what's happening. Oh, hang on. Maybe not. Let's just flip this a bit. There. Oh, jeez, I'm crow. What the hell is wrong with me? Yeah, she's going to a party. She's only 16, Thomas. She ain't getting married. And if she was getting married, do you think I'd be here, Thomas? Really? You think I'd really be here if my kid was getting married? <clears throat> oh, great. That's all screwed up now. Oh, man. Damn it. Told you, Zoe, me and technology have like a love-hate relationship. I'm freaking telling you. My technology hates me. Really f does. <clears throat> oh, and she's got more in here. Those are a couple too. <clears throat> Because I mentioned she was going to her friend's birthday party before I showed everybody, Thomas. Miss Zoe, are you still with us? <clears throat> okay. Just asking. I'm just questioning it. <clears throat> okay. Well, sorry. I didn't know you didn't hear me. I'm just, you know. She is very much into fashion, my 16-year-old, so she's already said she wants a good job, and she's really good at makeup and really good into the fashion stuff, and she's already swore that she's not going to have kids, but that might change, you know, depending if she finds the right guy. 
<clears throat> when she's older. But we are in no rush for that, are we? <clears throat> I apologize about the whole zooming situation. I just lifted my camera a bit, so that way... I mean, it's still zoomed in a bit, but... <clears throat> Uh, I think you spelt it right. Oh, yeah, I forgot Christina has that color along. She also has the magic jars from uh, Color Along. I, I want to um, get and join in Christina's uh, from uh, Coloring Book Cafe. I want to <clears throat> get a couple of those. <clears throat> Well, just one of those, but I want to, when I do get it, I'm going to have to catch up. I love Christina's channel. I do. <laughs> so, it looks right to me. I don't know. Or is it S-C-Y something, something, something? I don't know. I do want the Gabby Wolf, and I haven't seen a new Camellia book out as of yet, so I don't know if we're getting one this month or if she's skipping this month. That is the question. <clears throat> Gonna check. She's like, I gotta go check now. <laughs> oh, so funny. I love it. Our poor pups were so lost without us while we were gone. They were so happy when we got back though. So happy. I know this isn't perfect. I never said I was perfect with markers. And some of them bleed a lot more than others, which is weird. I don't know why it does it, but it does. They just bleed a lot more. And some of the other markers, I don't know if it's just because they're juicier and I haven't used them as much or what. But. Okay, so those are done. <clears throat> no H. Got the right letters in the wrong order. <laughs> ah, there it is. Oh, well, it looked right to me. It was a good try. True enough. I was trying to do it, so yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I find it blends better with the with the chisel tip end better than it does with the fine tip, the bullet. <clears throat> Okie dokie. So, oh yeah, I need my paint pens. I have to outline those to see what they look like. Whoa, whoa. Jeez Louise, Denise. crap everywhere. Okay, so we are going to go, let's see. That's a pain. I think this should do it. <clears throat> Let's see. <clears throat> How do you ever color in the Thomas Kincaid? Uh, yeah, I don't have that book. That book scares the bejeebers out of me, and I don't do the whole Disney thing. Not saying that I don't like Disney. I do like Disney stuff. Just I don't have any of the color by numbers by Hashit Heroes. I don't have any of that stuff. <laughs> There they go. <laughs> nice summer. Um, do you have ribbon? Down there. I just want to wrap or like put it. Where? 
in one of those boxes down there. I don't know. <coughs> How's that, Zoe? You like that, or? Did you find it? Yes. <clears throat> I think the scissors are in my bag. <clears throat> Who's that, Grayson? Hello, Grayson, my beautiful daughter. <laughs> They're in my purse. I told you that. Uh, over there with my son. Okay, so you like that color? I was I was looking at this color, but if you like the blue better, it yeah, we'll stick with the blue. <clears throat> okay. Joe, I'll outline these with my Thule art. These, this set here is the confetti set by Thule Art. It's my favorite paint pen set by them because the colors. I love the colors. <clears throat> You need help. Not, not long or not. It's long enough. No, not big enough. You mean thick enough? Yeah. Here, give it here. Give me my box. I do have thicker ones. Just give me a second. Uh, these aren't all my ribbons. I have more ribbon than this. Whole lot. Sorry, guys. Give me a second. Oh. But I have a little bit of a. Come on here. Somebody stole my ribbon. <laughs> Do you need help? No. You good? Beautiful. Oh, the joys. Of having to help. You have a few Thule arts, Callie? Yeah. I, uh, yeah, I have the, this is the confetti set. If you go on uh, Amazon, you'll see, like, if you go to the Thule art paint pens, um, they have different sets. Like, they have a Southwestern set, a Jewel set, um, I have the, I have their pastel set. I have to get a new pastel set um, because I've used my pastel so much. <clears throat> um, so I need a whole new pastel set. But I do love my paint pens. Um, I do have a set of um, jelly rolls in my. Amazon cart, but like I said, funds have not allowed me to purchase much of anything this year. I think I've gotten one book this year, maybe two, but nothing like, you know, <coughs> extravagant, <clears throat> nothing too much to, to, you know, <clears throat> you know, some years you're better off than others, you know, and this year just isn't off to a good start. Maybe near the end, it'll, or halfway through, we'll have some better luck, but I don't get happy mail like some people, and I really don't, I mean, I get happy mail from my friend Zoe and Steve, but I don't, I don't even advertise my wish list, to be honest. I mean, I think I've put it there on my <clears throat> description, but I haven't, yeah, it hasn't been updated or anything. Yeah, they are, they can be pricey. Um, I, tr I try to, uh, 
Which ones are pricey though? The are you talking about the Thule arts or are you talk like the paint pens or are you talking about um <clears throat> I don't know. I'm not good at that crap, Zoe. You know that. You've had to fix that part for me a thousand times because I'm not good at that crap. But I don't, you know, I don't expect it. You know what I mean? Like, I, I don't expect anybody to buy me anything. Like, I know some YouTubers, I'm not, I don't, like, I'm not friends with these YouTubers, but I've seen some YouTubers who expect you to donate or give them stuff you know and I'm not like that I'm happy with the things I have I consider myself blessed to be able to have what I have you know <clears throat> so I'm good with what I have and if I need something you know I'll I'm just, you know, I'm just not materialistic, really, to be honest. <clears throat> yeah, the Tule Arch can be pricey. I mean, they do go on sale every once in a while. Um, when I got the <clears throat> confetti set, because they were a new set, <clears throat> um, they were on sale at the time because, like I said, they were a new set coming out. And they were like half the price they are now. And that's the only reason I grabbed them, because I liked the look of them, so. <clears throat> okay, so those are all outlined. What do you think? You like those? <clears throat> and then I'll put a few little, like, stars on them as well when I, with my white paint pen at the end. <clears throat> Okie dokie. So, the tree. <clears throat> I don't want to go with a brown tree trunk, obviously. Because, well, I'm just that kind of person. <laughs> thank you, ladies. Thank you, thank you. So, let's see. <clears throat> what would look good with you? I'm wondering if I go like a strawberry pink or a coral. That's a strawberry pink right there. That's the fuchsia and that's the coral. <clears throat> but I can go with like light prawn and then shade with the coral color if I do that way. Or even with the strawberry pink. Because I like to be outrageous. <laughs> Or I can go with, like, a hydrangea blue. And, like, purpley kind of colors. Like, vine purple and hydrangea blue. For the tree trunk. Hmm, let's see. Because <clears throat> I might color her in the corally kind of colors. So, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go vine purple... For the tree and then shade it with either bluebell or hydrangea blue. <clears throat> I think that's what I'm gonna do. Mm. Do I have vine purple in the I have prune? Maybe I can do prune in the brush tips. <clears throat> okay, so I'm going to go with the prune in the brush tips <clears throat> for the tree. Um, I do have, like I was saying, I do have the... Um, some jelly rolls, mostly Stardust, because Zoe and myself, we were talking about getting me some new glitter gel pens, because what page was I doing, Zoe, that needed lots of glitter, and my pens just weren't, like, glittery enough? Can't remember what it was, but, yeah. 
So he's like, you need some jelly rolls. They're so sparkly. <laughs> I was like, me and jelly rolls have a love-hate relationship. Let's just put that way. <clears throat> I have the fluorescent ones. I just, yeah. Yeah, I can't remember what page I was doing. I think I was taught we were on video call with Miss Lynn and we needed sparkle on my one page and <clears throat> the sparkle I had was like really dull. <clears throat> Yes, she does, Callie, because she sent it to me and I put it in my cart because pretty much like in here, when I did the calculation of like all three books or whatever, it's like you get two of the books. Uh, you're pretty much paying for one, like one book is free in that compilation book. So I've got that one and I am looking forward to that one. I just, yeah can't afford it at the moment <clears throat> Zoe makes is it when I color with my alcohol markers and I watch Zoe doing it on her lives she makes using you make using the alcohol markers just so like Oh, what's the word I'm looking for? Hi, Mandy. Welcome back. <clears throat> you just make it look so effortless, if it makes any sense. Yeah, easy, effortless kind of thing. It just, yeah, I'm not, I'm not great at that stuff. I'm not precise. And wherever the cards fall, I guess, is the way I see it. the fact that I am so zoomed in it's like driving me crazy literally I don't know why it does that it's so strange I don't know it's very strange <clears throat> uh, color what you're feeling even if it's like a simple page or if you just feel like putting color to paper color anything what I do I try to pull out something simple to color <clears throat> when you feel like coloring but you're not sure what to color I try to go with like usually a camellia book will do it for me when I'm not sure what to color because there's so many choices I haven't put a video up in forever um, I need to I know I do it's just there's been so much going on in my life in my head right now that like, I don't even really have much of a haul to show, to be honest. Because I haven't really gotten much. <clears throat> the last haul I did was the last time I got anything, to be honest. I did see that Deborah Muller has a watercolor book out. And I know Zoe is not one for Deborah Muller's work. <clears throat> but 
I think that it's called Menagerie or something. But it's on watercolor paper. Uh, I believe Crystal's Coloring on YouTube did a review on the book, <clears throat> if I'm not mistaken. <clears throat> I'm not one for watercolors either, so... <clears throat> This one, or if I want to go with it's like purple. Well. Okay, we'll try lavender mist. <clears throat> uh, no, I don't think she's back on Amazon as of yet. <clears throat> yeah, I like it with the blue. Okay, so this one is like a, a bluey kind of color. So, let's see. How are we going to shade? <clears throat> hmm. My shading can be pretty, uh, especially when it comes to markers. Not going to be perfect, but it'll be something, right? Apologies for the awkward silence, guys. <clears throat> oh, I know. <clears throat> I've been checking for the last, like, week, I think, for Camellia's new book to drop and nothing. And I'm like, okay, well, maybe we're just going to be disappointed this month. I don't know. Who knows? Who knows? I'll end up blending it back out with the purple that I used. So there's not such harsh lines, but... here. I've missed everybody though, that's for sure. I've missed doing my lives with you guys. 
All right, so let's get my other color back out. Where'd you go? Here. <clears throat> I'll just go over it quickly. Hello, Candace. Welcome, welcome, darling. <clears throat> <laughs> Why? We need a new fairy house. I've been waiting for a fairy house, this one. Don't jinx that for me, Zoe. <laughs> mm. How are you, Candace? Not perfect, but it'll work for what I need it. And plus, it's supposed to be in space, so, you know. What do things look like in space? And if you think about it, <clears throat> and that's when I, like, when I'm coloring these pages, that's kind of what I think about, like, because... Technically, it's an imaginary planet. It, it's, you know, with cute little characters and stuff. So, in my head, I'm thinking, well, <clears throat> if it were my planet, I'd have lots of funky, weird, odd colors. Trees wouldn't look like normal trees. And, <clears throat> you know, things wouldn't look like they do here on Earth. <clears throat> and to them, you know... <clears throat> Our colors could be different, you know. Our colors could be strange to them for all they know, so. I try to put myself in the little creature's shoes, if that makes sense. <laughs> okay. That's my little tree. How's that looking? Does that look okay? <clears throat> How's my tree look? <clears throat> now for this little guy here <clears throat> oh yard work is so much fun isn't it I know they're not for you Miss Thing I'm glad you were able to catch me live. I like... I love everybody that catches me live. It means a lot to me. It really does. <clears throat> right? We could be the odd ones. I mean, there's no such thing as normal anymore. So, technically, <clears throat> in reality... Okay, so color choices for this little guy because we've got the purples and blues over here for the tree. Do we do like <clears throat> pinks or do we do like there's a mineral violet? Would that look nice with this? Like with the light pink as a base and then the mineral violet or we can color her mineral violet and do the light pink spots. <clears throat> You're right, normal is overrated. <clears throat> or should I go more like because uh, I don't want to overdo like the purple blues right with the whole page or should I go with a green or like a weird kind of yellowy green <clears throat> what are your guys' thoughts for her color <clears throat> I love getting suggestions from you guys because then it makes it feel like it's all of our page together it, in my head. That's the way I think of it. <clears throat> 
And as for the berries, Zoe, you're not helping. That's not helping. <laughs> I need colors that you think would look right, you weirdo. <laughs> I'm going to do light violet for the little berries in this. <clears throat> Call it light violet in this set, but it's more like a, I don't know, it's like a wine color to me. <clears throat> I can shade them after. Yeah, I might... <clears throat> I might go with like a mineral violet kind of color because it's like a... Yeah. I don't know. I just kind of like that color. It's one of the more used colors in the Oahu set that I do have. <clears throat> So have you decided, <clears throat> like you're doing, you're, blah, 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 blah. try again, first day with my new mouth and my new tongue, sorry guys. <coughs> Zoe, <clears throat> are you doing a complete review video on the new Ohuhu set that you got, or? <clears throat> <laughs> so, yeah. You know what I told my kids? Because we were in Toronto, and this, the town we come from is a very small town. And in Toronto, it's very, very busy. Very, very busy. So they got walking ahead of us. And I kept having to say, girls, get back here. Get closer to us. Don't go too far. And they kept doing it. And I said, listen, we're not in Kansas anymore. Like, we're very far from home. And in Toronto, it's known for guys grabbing young girls at the, like, my kids' ages. They're known for taking them for sex trafficking, and then the kids are gone. You know, and halfway across the world by the time you realize it. So, <clears throat> I wanted to keep them close. Maybe I'm an overprotective mom. Maybe I'm paranoid. I don't know. But, <clears throat> okay, Callie. No worries. <clears throat> Very true, very true. Because you got the whole Honolulu set. <clears throat> right, Zo? If I'm not mistaken, that's what you have. <clears throat> so, I think I'm going to use this color a little much. Um, I can try this one. And the mineral violet. Let me see. <clears throat> but yeah so I kept telling my kids like don't go too far like I don't need you to disappear got the whole of both now yeah cause I only got the 120's of the Oahu set so <clears throat> I'd like to know how much more to the Oahu set I need is it like another 300 like, is it a 300 set for the Oahus, or... <coughs> That's what I'm curious about. <clears throat> so, I am using the color of Thistle uh, as the base, and hopefully... Because I use this color quite a bit in my pastel set. Hopefully, hopefully... It won't die out on me, because it's just been my luck as of late. And I mean, Toronto is <clears throat> known for, you know, taking young girls and trafficking them. So, and I mean, there were a lot of young girls down there. <clears throat> so, I was like, and like I said, we come from a very small town where you can trust pretty much everybody. I mean, not everybody, everybody, but, you know, everybody pretty much knows everybody in the town. So... <clears throat> when we go to Toronto and there's like triple the people on just one street, you know, <clears throat> it's a little nerve wracking.
And I know, like, it's not parents' fault, like, that, you know, when their kids disappear. And a lot of, a lot of people will say, well, where the heck were the parents? Well, it's not on the parents all the time, like... You could be a parent like me that, you know, tries to keep in touch with your kids and stuff, but it can happen in the blink of an eye, you know. And you could be standing right there, you know, they're with you one minute, and the next minute they're gone, you know. It, it just, <clears throat> it's crazy. <clears throat> There's 320 Oahu and maybe some in the gray and skin tone. Okay. So, yeah, I'll have to see which ones I'm missing from, um, <clears throat> I'll have to go on Ohuhu's site and see which ones I'm actually missing from, because the set that I bought, the 120, those are my favorite colors out of the whole... Well, that's pretty good though I mean that is a good price but um were they they were the chisel and the bullet right <clears throat> remember I was telling you that the brush tips are a little bit more expensive than the that's my issue I love the brush tips but they're so much more expensive in the brush tips than they are <clears throat> Okay, so that's the stool. Okay, <clears throat> just wanted to make sure. Oh yeah, I definitely prefer the brush tips, like I said, but <clears throat> I usually opt for the um, chisel and the bullet nib because of that reason, because they're, you know, $30, $40 cheaper here sometimes. So unless they go on sale, then I jump on them when they do go on sale. Yeah, you're right. It is, uh, you know, worth it. But <clears throat> when you're on a limited budget, it's, you know, beggars really can't be choosers, in my opinion. But that's just the way I was raised. <coughs> <clears throat> So now I am going to use Mineral Violet for try to shade or outline or something, this little guy here. <clears throat> Oh, yeah, other than that, I'm just thankful that, you know, we got to spend time together as a family, me and my young girls and my husband, and <clears throat> very nice, so very nice. <clears throat> Candace, my sweet friend, are you still around, darling? I was just going to ask Candace how she's been doing. I haven't really heard much from her as of late. <clears throat> I love Candace. She's so sweet. One of the sweetest YouTubers. <laughs> yeah.
if it's, I'm pretty sure it's the Candace I'm thinking about. When does Zoe get back from her vacation? When she decides she wants to go home, I guess. Thomas? Is that a fair enough answer for you, darling? Sometimes people don't have set times to come back. They just decide when they want to go back. When they've had enough. <clears throat> I guess you can say. <clears throat> I think this color is pretty much perfectly, looks nice with the colors that I've chosen for this page. And I didn't have it planned. Like I know a lot of people plan out colors for their pages and stuff. I kind of just go with the flow and wherever it kind of takes me is where it takes me, I guess. I mean, there are times where I have planned the colors that I want to use, but it's not very often that it happens that way. <clears throat> I kind of match the colors as I color the page. I'm not one for color palettes um, either. I will try color palettes every once in a while if it's for an event or something which reminds me I am so behind on announcing winners for events in my group oh my gosh and adding new events so I'm behind there too <clears throat> I had to set up a whole new set of events for my group All right, <clears throat> so that's this one. <clears throat> I don't know, I think I'm gonna take... my thistle color and just kind of blend that out as it goes i want to come back the day after holiday but our taxi later lady is away till the 23rd so we waited well that's nice <clears throat> so it's the same girl that's driving you is that what you're saying nice I like that you know when you have that was like us when we went to Toronto same guy that dropped took us down picked us up so it was nice you know <clears throat> to have a familiar face you know just certain people you you more you know And they know, you know, they get to know what you like and what you don't like and, you know, stuff like that. And if you need to stop, they know pretty much where you'd like to stop most of the time. And, yeah, this guy was really sweet. And <clears throat> so 
some people are very humble, if that makes sense. I don't know. That's the way I see it. <clears throat> I like people like that who are very humble and accepting of, you know, you may not have a lot of money, but you're still human. And they treat you as such. They don't treat you like, oh, you don't have a lot of money? Well, you know, <clears throat> I don't want to deal with you or I don't want to drive you because you're poor or whatever, you know. <clears throat> just, yeah, I don't have time for people like that. I just, I don't look down on people because they are less fortunate than ourselves, you know, so. Yeah. <clears throat> nice, though. Nice. <clears throat> All right. And as for her spots, uh, let's see if we do like a, not an amethyst. Let's see the white hydrangea. Okay, we'll try this. <clears throat> and we'll see how this looks. I think this will be a nice color for her spots. And I'll just shade it with, I'll try to shade it with, I may not need to shade it for that. You like it? Mm -hmm. good. Thanks. You want? Hmm? Still want? Yeah. Oh, you want to see my one picture I did? It's one of my favorite pictures I've done this year. I was trying to go off of Land Before Time, you know, Sarah. Oh, yeah. The yeah. little, that's yeah. what I did her. Try to Sarah Jobs. Yeah. That looks good. I love this picture. It's one of my favorites for sure. <clears throat> yeah, I know, but I'm not that good, my love. I'm not. My hubby is saying his one friend said I should start framing my pages and selling them. I'm like, okay. I like to color, you know, but I'm not that good. All right. <clears throat> What do you think of that color for her, like, spots and stuff? What do you guys think? Hmm. Can I outline her spots, I think, a little bit? <clears throat> Thank you, Miss Zoe. <clears throat> Not doing complete outline. I'm just kind of doing like a little bit of a highlight. Thank you, Cindy. I didn't even see you pop in, darling. How are you, beautiful? I think Zoe, I think like when people pop in, like it does on Instagram, I believe, it shows you the name of the people popping in. <clears throat> <clears throat> I gotta color this part here. It was the prune purple. And then the, <clears throat> was that the light hydrangea I did? I think it was, no, it was lavender mist I used for the, this part here, the leaves, <clears throat> is what I used. Awesome, darling, awesome to hear. 
Now her little basket. Should I go with a brown or like a like a <clears throat> yellowy brown kind of color? Let's see what we can find in my markers here. <clears throat> it's like a mahogany. Nope, too brown. I don't want that. I want something a little lighter than that. More like a tan color. <clears throat> mm, we can go with a rose beige, I guess. Oh, let's see this color here. No, that's orangey. Um, hum, hum, hum. Let's see, let's see what we can find. Okay, let's go with a sand color for the basket. <clears throat> so we're gonna go with sand. I'll try to keep some things kind of similar to here, but. You are. Why not? Why not make things difficult and die out on me when I need you, right? Yeah. <clears throat> oh, come on, are you serious right now? <clears throat> Really gonna do this, aren't you? Yep, it is. Here, if we can darken that just a little bit. Not perfect, but it'll work. <clears throat> now, as for the stool, what should we do for the stool? Maybe like, what other pages do you have an idea you'd like to do this month, Dee? Um, hmm. Let me see, because I have picked out some, I just haven't really... I have a lot of my Camellia books out for the year tags though, so... Um, I haven't really figured it out, to be honest. I mean, I still have to finish a bunch of my stuff too, so... I'm not 100% sure, 
Um, this page should be done shortly, <clears throat> and I might do another camellia page, or at least start one. <clears throat> this goes with this. This goes in this set. This goes with that. This one goes with that set. Awesome. Yeah, I'm not sure as of yet, but we'll figure it out, girl. Because, like I said, this page is almost done. And I still have half hour to go, so... We can start another page after. <clears throat> Ooh, that's too bright of a color. Yeesh. No, no, no. <clears throat> um, color layer. Let's see. <clears throat> Let's go with... I want light rouge. Where is it? I think it's my prawn color. I need a prawn. Okay, we'll use this one. I have been really enjoying, um, you know, my prehistoric miniatures. I still, um, and there's a couple of pages I want to do out of my fairy house books that I have. I might actually do one of my Halloween fairy houses <laughs> that I haven't done in a while, a page from there. So there's that. <clears throat> And, oh crap, what color did I just use? I think it was like tea rose used. Was it? I think it was. I hope it was. <laughs> Pretty sure that's the color I just used. <clears throat> well. <clears throat> did ya? Yeah, there, I, I really wanted the um, Gabby Wolf, the newest one, because it's got a lot of pages that I want to color in it. But I'm just going to wait <clears throat> until, you know, until I can afford it, and then I'll get it. Okay, I'm going to use a deep cream for the ground here. find another color to kind of shade. And then her eyes and the little details in the little pomegranate, whatever the things are, with my white paint pen. And I think we'll call this page done as soon as I do those last little bits. <clears throat> so... You have it downstairs, so wink, wink, hint, hint, choose a page. Is that what you're saying? Rose. <clears throat> <clears throat> Okay, we'll try some ash rose here for some shading. <laughs> I 
<laughs> I was just saying. Which ones do you have? Oh, yeah, you have a bunch of um, buddy colors this month with all your camellia books, right? I forgot about that. You got a bunch of buddy colors. <laughs> all right, so there's that she did. All right, <clears throat> now we're going to go with her eyes, which I think... I'll try to go they are <clears throat> using my <clears throat> Arteza uh, black paint pen and I'm just gonna black out her eyes right here uh. I know everybody does eyes different um, this is the way I do mine don't have to do them this way I know a lot of people leave that part white I don't I color them black I don't know why it just for her eyelashes and stuff it's not perfect but it works for me do the little dots <clears throat> yeah I thought the green would look nice with her I don't know I don't know why I always like do green alien eyes or like a yellowy kind of color to their eyes <clears throat> it's just the way I do it all right so we're just gonna put a few dots <clears throat> like so Highlights here and there. 
I usually just do the highlights where I think looks decent. I don't know. It's just the way I do it. <clears throat> and I think we are done. <clears throat> so that's the final product. What do you guys think? I could do a background and I could outline this, but I don't know. I'll, I'll do a background probably with chalk pastel or something, but that's what it looks like so far. What do you guys think? You like her or... <clears throat> Yeah, I kind of like it. I mean, not very many colors going on, but you don't need a lot of colors, so. <clears throat> Alright, so there's that one. Now, let's see <clears throat> what else we can start while we are here. Oh, my goodness. Um, let's see. <clears throat> Okay, so I might do a fairy house, and I know. <clears throat> There's one of them that I wanted to do. <clears throat> and it's like a little sand castle one. I mean, I could do the lighthouse one, because I have a lighthouse prompt on my... <clears throat> Um, scavenger hunt for this month, but <clears throat> I kind of like where is it? I gotta find it now. Ha 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 ha. So there's a couple in this book that I like. <clears throat> It's one of my favorite books, actually, this uh, fairy house one. I wish you would come out with another one, to be honest. Come on, where's that damn sandcastle one? Okay, oh goodness. Okay, so there is this one. <clears throat> Oops, sorry guys. Let's see if I can lift the camera a bit. Okay, so there's this one in this book. And then there is... Just gotta find it. Where did it go? I had my finger on it and it slipped when I put the page up on the table here. <clears throat> no, not that one. There's that one, but I like the one with the turtle better. Where did it go? Or oh, this one. I like this one. <clears throat> And there's the other one that I like as well. There's this one here, but I'm going to wait for closer to summer for that one. This one's cute too. <clears throat> that one's cute. That one's cute. That's the lighthouse one. <clears throat> I like that one too. <clears throat> So yeah, there's this one here, and then the sandcastle one that I can start. <clears throat> so I'm just thinking of colors, that's what I'm looking at. When I look at these pages, I'm thinking of the colors that I want to use. Where's that one? Where's that other one? There was another one that I could see the colors of it in my head. <clears throat> it definitely wasn't that one. Yeah, I think it was the sandcastle one that I wanted. Yeah, there's that sandcastle one and then the other one 
And there's this one, the, the little lizard. <clears throat> um, this one could be cute because <clears throat> the green for the cactuses, the pink and stuff with that one. And then there's this one here that for some reason reminds me of like Ariel. I don't know why, it just does. <clears throat> Hmm. <clears throat> I kind of like this one a little better, or this one. <clears throat> so which one do you guys like? This one or the other one? <clears throat> I'm not sure. I'm kind of drawn to both, to be honest. <clears throat> But I can't see the colors for this yet, so. This one here, I could see the purples and the tealy greens because of Ariel. So I think I might stick with this one. <clears throat> yeah. Okay, I'm going to stick with this one. Just give me a second, guys. <clears throat> probably hurts a lot of your ears for me ripping it out. Yeah, we're going to start with the sand castle for now. <clears throat> okay, dokie, schmokie. Let's bring you guys down a bit. <clears throat> Everybody's so quiet. Everybody's so quiet here. Okie dokie. Um, <clears throat> <clears throat> oh, it's zoomed in again. I have to figure this out. Why it's so zoomed in. So strange. It's very strange. I don't know why. <clears throat> <Whoa. clears> throat> Throwing things away. Okay. Let's see. Usually with these, though, I will base with marker. And then I will shade because, like, I want more depth to them. Yes, hello to all the lurkers. <clears throat> um, I want to check my... a certain color I was looking at. Cotton pearl. I could use the cotton pearl. Um, <clears throat> Grease cherry is too pinky. And pearl color <clears throat> for the sandcastle color. <clears throat> so yes, this one, this page here is from the um, Camellia Androkova's uh, 50 Vacation and Summer Fairy Houses book. It's actually one of my favorite books. I color a lot of pages out of this. I love the fairy houses. I haven't found any other artist who draws fairy houses other than, well, I can't say that. Her, Camelia and Jacoba and um, Alexander Franzese are the only two people that I've seen do fairy houses <clears throat> that I really enjoy doing. I have not found any other books that I enjoy. I'd love a Fairy Doors book like Camellia does in a lot of her. She adds them into her miniatures books a lot of the time. But 
I'm trying to get her to do one of just the fairy doors. I'd be in my glories. I'd probably buy like two copies, to be honest. <clears throat> yeah, it's so quiet in here today. Huh. Just everybody kind of chilling and listening and... <clears throat> So there are a bunch of new books, I guess, coming out. Uh, you can pre-order them on Amazon. They will be coming out within the next few months. <clears throat> so that's something to look forward to, to add to my wish list, to be honest. Um, but like I said, I, I've been so picky about my books lately that there hasn't been much that have caught my eye, if that makes sense. I don't know, it's funny how, how much, <clears throat> like, I've been coloring, as you guys know, for so many years, like 13 years, and my taste in uh, what I color has changed so much from when I first started coloring. It's, it's kind of interesting to see. <clears throat> I don't know if it's influenced from other colorists that you just kind of, you see them color a page and you're like, ooh. I want to try something like that. I could do that, you know. I don't know if that... And, and I mean, as we grow in our coloring journey, you know, we start having a little bit more trust in ourselves, too. So, that's the other thing. We know what we can handle and what we can't. <clears throat> What color is this? This is from my pastel set. <clears throat> it is Cotton Pearl E020. Now I don't know if it's in your set. It's Cotton Pearl though. That's the name of the color. If I know you go by the numbers though, but I don't know. Uh, the numbers, like you said, are different for different sets, so... <clears throat> it's considered a nice skin tone. Let's just put it that way. So, yeah, I'm thinking I am going to try and make this like um, <clears throat> Ariel from Disney, the, the colors. Um, I, it's from the Honolulu set, so, <clears throat> Honolulu. <clears throat> yeah, I like it for sand, too. It's a nice color. So I'll probably use a lot of teals, like tealy greens and purples and some pinks, you know. Yeah, please feel free to say hi and say, you know, we're not judgmental here. You're more than welcome to join in conversation. Anything you want to talk about, if you have questions, anything like that, feel free to ask. <clears throat> I promise we won't bite. Looking at trying my hand at some mythographic books this year. A little later this year when the ones that I really want come out. <clears throat> um, so, yeah, I'm going to look into those. But there are quite a few myth new mythographic coming out. 
this year. Um, ow, 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 that hurt. Oh, Ow, jeez. <clears throat> the lonely song, I'm so lonely. <laughs> Welcome back, Thomas. I come home and my oldest daughter and my son-in-law had my house so clean. She did such an amazing job. She wanted to surprise us when she got home, when we got back from the, the hospital there. And she just wanted, you know, to surprise us. And she was so proud and I was so proud, you know. She's like, I was bored, so I cleaned up everywhere. <laughs> I was like, well, I'll take it. Now, <clears throat> oh shoot, do you think I should change the color of the sand down here on the ground though, or should I keep it the same as the rest of it? <clears throat> what do you think? I think I might go a little different for that color, <clears throat> to be honest. <clears throat> but uh, we are at, <clears throat> yeah, that's what I was thinking, right? So like a ash kind of color, maybe. But <clears throat> um, I am at the two hour mark, so we are going to call it a day for today and I will probably be back live at some point um, next week what's today today's Saturday so yeah I will be live at some point next week um, I've really missed everybody so I really enjoyed being here and seeing everybody and talking to everybody again but, yeah, until the next... I know, everybody's leaving. My heart's breaking. It's okay. It's all good. It's all good. I'm done anyway, so it's all good, honey. <laughs> but, yeah, so... Um, yeah, so thank you all for joining me. You guys are all amazing. All my little dreamers. I love you all. Big hugs. And until my next live, my dreamers... Remember to stay safe, be kind, keep smiling, and uh, remember you're not alone, and big hugs. Bye. <clears throat>